Yes, yes, guys, this is Nilly. Now let's bring you back another gameplay for today. This time, guys, we are talking about the parabolic microphone and whether we want this to return to Black Ops 3 or not. Now, as we know, this works by suppressed gunfire being seen on the minimap. And they appear by red circles instead of the normal red dots that you see. Now, when Advanced Warfare first came out and previously before it came out, a lot of people heard about this attachment, and this was the most talked about attachment I felt out of all the ones coming out. And now Advanced Warfare decided, you know, this should be a counter for a counter, basically. You know, you use a silencer, there should be a counter for that, for someone else to use to be able to find you on the map. Which, to me, it is understandable, it's fair enough. Now, the question is, is whether we want this to come back again. Was this overused? Now, personally, I think a lot of people thought that they were going to put it on straight away. Because silencers are very, very much used, especially at the beginning of uh, New Call of Duty. For the reason being that people really don't know how the game's going to play out. They don't know the map layouts or nothing else like that. And appearing on the mini-map constantly is not really going to help you favour. I mean, there is the other argument to that side that... People were like, well, I, I don't really care, do you know what I mean? I, I don't like silences whatsoever, which is fair enough. Now, they probably were used a lot at the beginning of Advanced Warfare. Now, the question is, did that stop people using the silencer? Now, when I play the game, you do come across people using silencers and that, but it's nothing like previous Call of Duties at all. Now, when you had Ghosts, obviously you had the Honey Badger, which was like one of the mainly used games. And obviously that had an integrated silencer. And obviously you didn't have a parabolic microphone. So that was used quite a lot. A lot of people about to get in and around the map all the time using that. So that's one thing. Even in Black Ops 2 days, I mean, you could use like the um, MSMC. And you could put a silencer on that. And you could still run and put people down quite easily and keep off the mini-map. So, is it that fair without having a counter for it? Now, by putting the parabolic microphone into this game, has it taken out a whole genre of playstyles? That's the question. A lot of people are saying, you know, if people have got a whole class set up, and that's the way they play, they like to play stealthy, they should be allowed to play that way without something like this happening. Obviously, there is the other argument to it as well. I mean, some people say, okay, if it is overused, maybe that the mic should have like a smaller radius and that it shouldn't allow to be heard or seen on the map through the whole of it. You know, it should just have a little tiny radius around it so it can just pick up so maybe you can hear people in and around you or people sneaking up behind you. I personally don't really mind it too much. I don't really see the problem with it. I do personally think that there should be a counter for a counter. And I don't really have any problems with it returning. But let me know in your thoughts on this, guys. It would be interesting to hear. So leave it in the comments section below. Or contact me on Twitter. You know, whether you want this to come back. Whether you think it's changed the game. Or whether you think that because there's not many silences left. Whether the game is speeded up somewhat. Because there's no point trying to sit around and camp. Or maybe it is just the exos. But anyway, guys. As you can see coming up on the screen now is my subscribe button. Please click on that for me, guys. And check some more daily videos. And please drop a like on this channel and this video and it will help me out knowing anyway guys this is going to be nearly last and I'll catch you later